All right, here we go. This is the big day, June 10th, 2016. Anyway, so yesterday we ended up, uh, you know, kind of doing the final things. We got everything kind of packed. We got everything loaded, some final signatures, got a little bit organized. And, uh, and now all I got to do is just load the car and I'm out of here. to unload the House of Representatives last. So let me throw them in first. Okay. Yeah, here, just load them in there. When we get them out there, we'll load them. Okay. That's the way we need to do. Here, we'll start with one. So you want yeah, where's one? one? There's one. Yeah, okay. And then we'll do two. Seven's probably under there. Yep. Okay, seven right there. backpack because I got stickers, I got posters, I've got buttons, I got the little pins the guys are going to wear. So when I come walking into the office, I got a couple little tie wraps here from the guys. Austin's going to be strapped right to here. Can you imagine me walking through all the uh, house and the Capitol and all that with a little ostrich around here? So when I end up basically coming in to introducing myself, I, uh, I've got Austin right here. I introduce him and at some point, if I need to, uh, if somebody's in there and I need him and they want to be a spark for change, I can do a Facebook post like this. They're on my left. Austin's in the middle and we take a shot. I'm President Barack Obama and I support this message. I'll have him up front where he can watch. Check this out, Rand McDowley Road Atlas. When's the last time you used one of those? In case my GPS gives up the ghost. Button. Thousand posters. I should be handing those out on the capital step with my ostrich. All right. That ought to fit there. I am loaded for bear. We are uh, headed to Florence, South Carolina for the night. Then I've got a uh, stop up to see my friend uh, at the Military Aviation Museum. He's actually having an event on Saturday night, so I'm going to stay there, have a little bit of time to enjoy that. And then it's about a four hour drive to Washington. So, anyway, wish me luck. I have no idea what to expect, but this is going to be an exciting adventure. <laughs> Okay, here we go. We got Phil, Phil outside filming, and we are off on an adventure. I am going to Washington, D.C. I cannot even believe it. I got all my airplanes out on the ramp right now. There's a big party coming up. I'm going to miss that. Um, heading to Florence, South Carolina tonight. I got a room booked there, and uh, should get me in time reasonably. So I'm, with, I'm hoping like about six o'clock or something like that will give me a chance to relax and rest. So anyway, cool. Over and out. Yeah, so I just got on the interstate, leaving Fantasy a flight. Got the GPS set up, seven hours and two minutes, if the traffic's not bad. I'll bypass a little bit around Orlando where it is bad. And uh, anyway, so it's kind of interesting, you know, kind of flashing back to my days when I used to go to aerobatic contests and basically, you know, you kind of leave off on a trip and 
you know, there's all this anticipation and anxiety as to, you know, what you're going to expect uh, up ahead, and uh, you kind of get a feel of energy that you're launching off on an adventure. There's a bit of, you know, tinge of, like I said, anxiety inside. So it's kind of interesting. I have no idea what to expect, but uh, we shall see. And I've got Austin set up with me here. He's uh, enjoying the journey with me. So anyway, we will. Uh, See how it goes. Hopefully make it to Florence, South Carolina in time to have a nice meal and some rest. Okay, so five o'clock we rolled into Florence, South Carolina. We checked into a Holiday Inn Express, Austin and I. Anyway, so that was a good day of driving. Uh, did some phone, phone calls on the way. Here's another one. Over and out.